Hello everyone and welcome to Advanced Advertising's Key Product Spotlight where we focus on certain promotional products in our industry and how they can better be used to help market your business. Now as we roll into 2020, I'm going to spend a little bit more time uh, taking a look at the four key areas that we at Advanced Advertising look at when we're identifying ways to help customers grow their business. That would be brand image, promotional marketing, merchandise solutions, and loyalty gifts. So today, what I want to talk to you about is brand image. So let's take a look first and foremost at lapel pins and name tags. Now that might seem a little boring, but I'm going to tell you why it's important. When you're taking a look at how you go to market, what's your strategy? Are you wearing um, an item with your brand on it? Now in this case, I am underneath here, ta-da, but I'm cold in the conference room today, so I'm wearing this. Now, but that's a perfect solution for you because what happens in that situation where you're out in the market and you need to look the part, but, but something's changed. Maybe you're wearing a, a garment over top like a suit coat and you can't necessarily uh, have that embroidered because it just doesn't look right having a blazer that's embroidered. That's where lapel pins come into play. So for an example, they come in all shapes and sizes. This one is a, uh, has been stamped and then it's filled with an enamel, very nice lapel pin. This one, I'm gonna get it zoom in close for you here. Actually, let's see if it'll focus, is a relief, looks like a coin that we had made for, um, this was the Women's Suffrage Centennial Celebration uh, out in Iowa. So we actually took a picture of, of a famous woman in that movement did a relief of her face and put it on here almost like a coin. Lots of cool different ways that you can do lapel pins. This one is for a Lutheran uh, organization. You can spend about three bucks a piece. You can do something that's a little less expensive like this one, which has a uh, full color imprint and then a, a polydome um, epoxy cover on it. Um, that's a little less expensive to do than something like this that's actually cast metal with color enamel. But the benefit of these items is you can just add it to your garment that you're wearing and it looks good. It lets people know who you are, where you're from. So let's say you're the president of a bank, um, you work for an attorney's firm, you work for a financial institution, um, an accountant, and you want to look sharp, but you still want to get your brand out there lapel pins are a great way to do that. On the flip side, obviously, is name tags. So in a case like this, you might be, let's say, a restaurant that can't necessarily uh, provide every single employee with some sort of logoed garment because of the cost factor. You don't know when your employee uh, shows up to work that first day if they're gonna be there the second day. So what you can do is give them a nice branded shirt that could be worn again by another person that wears the same size, and then you create a nice little name tag for them uh, either customized with their name on it or something that's a little more generic that just has your name of your operation on there and then you can use one of those tag machines and put the employee's name on there, peel it off if they stop working there. But the big picture is when they're out in the market or when they're at the table or when they're meeting with clients, they look the part. They know that you are from that organization and you're representing them. People feel safe when they can identify somebody. So if they can identify where you're from, it puts their mind at ease and their ears are open to, to whatever services you're offering them. So just some ways that you can use lapel pins and name tags. Check out some other key product spotlights coming up here shortly. I wish you nothing but the best. Have a wonderful day.